It is Monday. Do the mask a mask Monday. So, I feel like I really need a mask because I've started to have a little breakout. I don't know why. I got one little friend here. I got another one like here and I did have one here. Not great. Today I'm doing Garnier Skin Active Nutri Bomb Milky Tissue Mask. It intensely nourishes and restores. So it sounds delicious. It's just a 15 minute sheet mask. I've not done this one before. I've done a couple of the other Garnier ones which I loved. So it'd be great to try this one. It's relatively new I think. I've only just started seeing it about. I actually got mine from Amazon and I think it was about two quid. And I'll put a link in the description below if you wanna check it out. Let's have a read of the instructions. Unfold the mask, gently apply it on clean face. Adjust the mask to the contours of your skin. Leave for 15 minutes, remove the mask, massage in the excess serum, use it on your neck, or remove it with a cotton pad. That's pretty cool. I really like the like images and stuff for the little instructions. I think they're really good. It's much funner to see them like this than just a big chunk of text. Right, let's give it a go. Oh, yum, that smells really good. Wow. Oh my gosh, take a look in there. Look at that, it looks really like, kind of gross. <laughs> okay, so it smells incredible. It smells really fresh, and it smells dirtlish, actually. It smells really like almond milky. I'm excited. So before we get started, I'm gonna take off my face and then we'll bung this on okay so I've taken off all my makeup from today and now you can see the full extent of my friend so let's give this a go so it's just a 15 minute mask so that's cool plenty of time to just bung it on and relax uh, the mask is quite thick which is great and it actually seems to have held all of the like serumy product on the mask which is great there's not much left in the packet get the nose flap down okay so here we go oh that is cold that is lush I do love that bit this nose bit looks well weird oh look it's right hmm so now it's on I just gotta leave it 15 minutes chill out and let it work its magic back in a bit so it's been about 15 minutes and this mask is really starting to dry out so it's like my skin I guess is sucked in all this moisture because this is like starting to flap off here is kind of like flappy much drier I mean it's still kind of wet here and here but here and here well dry amazing okay so let's take it off Okay, so the packet says to massage in any excess stuff. Get it all down your neck and your chins. That is lush. I think I'm just gonna kind of like leave it on for a bit to soak in a bit more. That was good. So, overall, what do I think? I think it smelled incredible, really delicious, really light and creamy. It was nice and easy to use. The actual mask itself was really, really thick. Thick enough that it really held the like goo on the mask. It's not been messy. I know I've had some experiences with face masks, especially the sheet mask with like lots of liquid where I'm covered at the end of it, but I've got nothing on me now, which is fab. It was only two pounds on Amazon, which I thought was a bargain considering I think it's relatively new. So overall, I think I'd give this mask out of 10, maybe a 10. I loved it. It's actually been a really pleasant, relaxing time, which was great. I'd definitely give it a go again. So this isn't an ad or a sponsor or anything, it's just this week's Monday mask, something that I actually loved. Defo, 10 out of 10, will use again. Amazing. If you guys have tried this mask or any of the other Garnier masks, drop me a comment below and let me know what you thought of them. Or if you have any ideas for face masks that I could try in the future, pop them below and I'll definitely check them out. So on that note, guys, I'm kind of done for the day. 
think it's time for a cup of tea and a bit of a chill before bed. A great way to end my day. I've loved it.